The Children's Ministry of the Church of Pentecost over the weekend launched one of its flagship program called the Community Children's Club, CCC. This initiative is aimed at spreading the gospel in communities by identifying peculiar challenge or need and using children as a tool to address it. As they address this need, they also win souls for the Lord. It's with this concept that the CCC was officially launched at Burma Camp Accra, Ghana. Let's watch the official launch by the General Secretary-Elect of the Church of Pentecost, Apostle Samuel Jawu Obuobi. Now, on behalf of the Chairman and Executive Council of the Church of Pentecost, and in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, we, standing here, jointly declare the Community Children's Club of the Church of Pentecost duly launched in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost. May the Lord alone be given the glory. May His name alone be praised. We pray in the name of Jesus Christ that this shall be a beacon of hope. A beacon of hope. That this shall be an instrument for transformation. That the glory of the Lord shall be seen in each community and each club. To the glory of the Father and to the glory of the Son and to the glory of the Holy Ghost. Shall we put our hands together for the Lord? Shall we make a joyful noise unto the Lord? Hallelujah. Give him praise. Give him glory. Bless the name of the Lord. And put your hands together for Jesus. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Hallelujah. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Please be seated. Thank you very much. During the launch, a documentary by Pent TV and a drama sketch by a group called Gifts from God were all highlights of the program. When is she going to help? Huh? Wait. Speaking as the special guest of honor, the mayor of Accra Metropolitan Assembly, Honorable Elizabeth Saki, charged the children to see the nations as the lords and go possess it. Little ones, no matter your age, the Lord wants to use you. My dear ones, no matter how old you are, God is ready to use you as a tool to equip you and to quicken you to get more souls unto his kingdom. My brothers, you can do it. My sisters, you can make it. We can possess the nation. The nation does not belong to anybody. It belongs to God. And it is God who has given us the power and authority to possess the nation. As usual, after the launch, Gifts TV was there to interact with some officials and leaders of the children's ministry. We wanted to find out what impact will this community children's club have on our societies. And this is what they said. In fact, uh, the children in my community are blessed because they always use me as an example. After telling them of what Jesus can do in the life of you as a person, and I've always encouraged them. I've also taught them a lot. No lying, no stealing, no misbehaving because of what the Bible is teaching us to do. We should obey our parents in the Lord. And this was one of the stories I really imparted into them. Now I'm so happy because their parents even are coming to the meeting. The city, they don't see themselves as children. They say they want to listen to what the children are listening to 
and that is also imparting on the lives of the adults that their parents so they even came along with me here to listen to and i'm happy what they've seen when they go home they themselves and other children's parents they will go and tell them of what they've seen and then uh, I'm, I'm very happy that very soon my house will be full with all children that needs to know christ jesus yeah. okay thank you so much yeah. this is, is, has been a heart desire from matthew chapter 18 and verse 14 jesus said that it is not the will of the father that any of these little ones should perish and this ECC has been our dream and we were only praying that the Lord will grace us so that our dreams will become a reality and I thank God that today it has become a reality because based on that we can reach out to all the children in the community for to know the saving knowledge of Christ and we will also try to disciple them to become responsible citizens in the near future who will intend rule this nation take over the church and also the community and i think to me we are in the right direction and i thank god for that thank you so much for your time you are welcome. so i think the community children's club is a very innovative intervention of the children's ministry and if we all children's workers um children ourselves in the church if we commit to it you are going to win a lot of souls souls that we never thought of winning so we just have to commit to it and make the effort when we make the effort god and the holy spirit will do the rest so i think it's a very innovative intervention so it is left for us to commit to it and it will definitely work thank you for your time it's a good uh, innovation the church is going to win a lot of people in our community we were, we were doing it we were doing it but uh, this time, it's very open. It's not only the children, but pastors, elders, everybody in the church can form half a community around his or her house. And then we will win more young guys into the church so that we will teach them the good values of how to live good in life. Yes. Okay. Thank you so much Thank for your you time. Too. Oh, it's been very inspiring. In fact, we can i can now i can, my eyes are open i can see the clear benefits of holding ccc so as i'm going home i plan to start one in my own community because i realize through ccc uh, a parent can even say i will surrender my life to jesus this means a lot to me yeah. thank you so much for your time